5 Tips for Negotiating a Car Price The thought of haggling with a car dealer can be enough to keep some shoppers away from the dealership, but when you take the time to prepare before you buy, you can take the fear and anxiety out of negotiating a car's price. Doing a little legwork before you walk into a dealer's showroom can not only give you confidence, but may also help you save money on your purchase. We'll explore 5 simple tips to help you successfully negotiate a car deal, and walk you through a car buying scenario. Whether you plan to buy a new or used car, you can prepare yourself before visiting the seller by following these 5 simple tips. First, do your research. Knowledge puts you in a better position to negotiate the price of a car. With so much information available online, buyers can easily find information about a car's value before setting foot inside a dealership. The manufacturer's suggested retail price, or MSRP, is the estimated price that the car maker thinks the vehicle is worth. Also known as the sticker price, the MSRP gives you a baseline for beginning negotiations. But what you may not know is that few cars actually sell for the MSRP, which provides you with room to negotiate a better price. Instead, your focus should be on the car's fair market value. This value is based on the average amount paid for the vehicle by other buyers in your area, which is typically less than a car's MSRP. The fair market value may be influenced by other factors such as supply, demand and optional features. Knowing the vehicle's market value may help you secure a better deal when negotiating a car's price. Second, keep your options open. If you walk into the dealership intent on buying a specific model or trim, your ability to negotiate a better price may be limited. When dealers know you have your heart set on a certain car, they may not feel as compelled to negotiate the price because they know your mind's made up. Instead, choose a vehicle that best suits your needs and keep your options open so that you hold more power in the negotiation. Third, get pre-approved. Getting pre-approved for an auto loan before you walk into a dealership or visiting a private seller can be a good idea. Whether you work with your bank or an online lender, getting pre-approved can help you stay within your budget when buying a car. Plus, you can shop around for a reasonable interest rate. Getting pre-approved may help you when negotiating the purchase price of your car. If the salesperson knows you already have a loan lined up, they may be motivated to offer you an in-house financing offer with a better rate or terms than your pre-approved offer. Fourth, focus on out-the-door price. One of the first questions you may be asked is how much you can afford to pay each month. Salespeople often focus on how to make the monthly payment fit into your household budget, diverting your attention from the total cost of the vehicle. To keep the monthly payments in your price range, dealers may extend the length of your loan, actually increasing your total cost to own. Fifth, be willing to walk away. A car is a big financial commitment. You should feel comfortable with both the vehicle you choose and the price you pay. Salespeople may talk quickly and place a lot of pressure on you to take their deal on the spot. They may claim that the deal is only good for a limited time. As the customer, you always have the upper hand. You can walk away if you don't like what they are offering or if you just want more time to think it through. This may not be easy if you need a car immediately, but it's worth the time to come back another day or visit a different dealer.